In 1945, churches from the UK and Ireland united to respond to a desperate refugee crisis across Europe. Soon after, Christian Aid was founded. Now, in 2012, we're launching an ambitious new strategy, Partnership for Change, the power to end poverty. It has one clear aim, to support marginalised or excluded people to free themselves from poverty. Our strategy responds to a changing world. A world in which advances in medicine, agriculture, finance and technology mean that we now have the greatest opportunity to overcome poverty. Yet the will to share these resources with the poorest people on our planet is still lacking. Our goal is to bring people of all faiths and none together to change the way that power is shared and to transform our unjust world. Ours is the wealthiest generation in human history, but it's also the most unequal. In 2012, it's too simple to see the world as the wealthy North and the poverty-stricken South. Today, people in poverty don't just live in low-income countries, they also live in middle-income countries like India and Brazil, where extreme poverty rubs shoulder to shoulder with extreme wealth. So in order to tackle this injustice, we have to rethink our understanding of poverty. We have to think in terms of poor communities, not simply poor countries. Poverty is about much more than a lack of income. Poverty denies opportunity. It takes away the power of people to shape their own lives and provide for their families. Everyone should have the power to be able to live their life in all its fullness. To achieve this, we want to see a world where the Earth's resources are shared fairly between rich and poor and where economic growth is sustainable and sensitive to the environment. A world where every woman, man and child is able to participate fully in the decisions that shape their future. And where everyone has the right to thrive, not just survive. Over the next few years, Christian Aid will demand that governments and other institutions share power fairly. And we will help to increase equitable access to health services, create just economic policies and practices which will support people living in poverty to build sustainable livelihoods and to withstand disasters, create a more inclusive world where gender, ethnicity, caste, religion, class and sexual orientation is no longer a barrier to equality and will help to protect vulnerable people from violence and to resolve conflicts peacefully. Our experience over the last 60 years has taught us that we cannot make these changes by acting alone. So whether you're a village trader, a Christian Aid Week collector, a businesswoman or a government official, you all have a role to play. With your courage and your commitment, together, through the power of our relationships, we can transform the world.